Hello students, how are you? Hope you are doing well. Now the question is, an electric dipole, dipole moment P equals to PIE, consisting of charges minus Q and Q separated by a distance to A, is placed along the x-axis with its center at the origin. Show that the potential V due to this dipole at a point X, where X is very greater than A, is equal to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught PI kef upon X square. So the problem is based on the topic, the electric potential due to an electric dipole. So the dipole consists of two charges, minus Q and plus Q. Now this particular dipole is placed along the positive X axis and uh, the distance of the dipole is given as 2A. So this is 2A distance between the charges. And uh, at the center of, from the center of the dipole, at a distance of X, there is a point, suppose it is P, at this particular point, we have to calculate the potential. So the basic concept used here is that the potential is calculated by this particular formula, V equals to 1.4 pi epsilon naught Q upon R, where Q is the charge and at a point P, suppose we are calculating this particular potential, which is at a distance of R. So this is the formula which we are using to solve this particular problem. And uh, since the potential is a scalar quantity, not a vector quantity, uh, only the respective sign is taken, not the direction. So, we have to find out the individual potentials due to these respective charges and then add up algebraically. So, corresponding to this positive charge, the potential at a point P is given by 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught Q upon X minus A because the distance is this distance is X this is A then this is X minus A so this is 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught Q upon X minus A similarly we can calculate the potential at point P due to this particular negative charge the distance of the point P with respect to this negative charge is X plus a this is a this is x so the total distance is x plus a so we get this value as 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught minus q in brackets and x plus a so this is the potential at this particular point this due to this negative charge and we have to calculate the total potential so the total potential is the algebraic sum of these two potentials so we have to calculate the algebraic sum which is equal to V plus Q and V minus Q. So this value comes out to be 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught. This is the common quantity and uh, Q is also a common quantity and we get this value as 1 upon X minus A minus 1 upon X plus A. Now after solving this, this comes out to be Q upon 4 pi epsilon naught and X plus A minus X plus A upon x square minus a square x minus a to x plus a is x square minus a square now after solving this after solving this expression we get the final expression as v equals to q upon 4 pi epsilon naught times 2a upon x square minus a square now this q into 2a is nothing but the dipole moment so in place of this q into 2a, we can put the value as p upon 4 pi epsilon naught x square minus a square. Now since the direction of the dipole, dipole moment is along the x-axis, so we can write it in the vector form like this, p dot i cap upon 4 pi epsilon naught. And since we are given that uh, x is very greater than a, it implies that x square is very greater than a square so in this particular bracket we can neglect this a square so the answer is p dot i cap upon 4 pi epsilon naught x square so this is our final expression which we have to derive so this is the solution of this particular problem so hope you understand the solution thank you